We're back with more of our series, Living to 100, and that secret Sardinian soup that just might be a key ingredient to living a healthy life. Anthony Scotto of Fresco by Scotto is going to do the honors for us this morning. Good Thank morning. You. How are you? Great. So this is a minestrone soup, but it's a little different. Yeah, and it's all about a lifestyle too, right? Okay. So you got that. But let's, let's talk about this minestrone soup. It's all about the freshness of a garden. It's everything that's there. What they've used in Sardinia, we've exampled here, is all exceptional beans. Just everything that's dried and terrific. We use dried, not canned, not less canned. sodium. More, more fiber, okay. okay? We've used fennel tops, cut them, cut them into everything and done it with that way also. So let's start. We have all of our beans here that we've dried overnight. Are these you beans you can get anywhere, not just anywhere, in Sardinia? Anywhere you can get them, it's fine. It could be any bean, Matt. It doesn't have to be these specific beans oh. that are here. Okay. okay. Chickpeas, uh, pinto beans, I have a little tomato. So we're adding that all in right now. We're then going to start with all of our vegetables. Okay. We have a little garlic. We have a little fennel. I love fennel tops. It yep. gives another intense flavor to this. Potatoes. And they're basically using what's fresh at whatever time of the season. Exactly right. Uh, you know, if you saw the segment also, uh, Matt, they use a little pork fat in the winter time just to give a little bit more of a bulk. But fennel's a must do if you can. Fennel's a must do. We're going to okay. add tomato to this. And we're going to let this simmer for about an hour and a half. Okay. After about an hour and a half, it's here. This is the stage we're at. Okay, it's going to start to thicken. Potatoes are in there. Everything is there. We're going to add a fregula. Fregula is a sardine, a Sardinian pasta. Okay. It's very easy. I actually like toasting it ahead of time. Oh. It needs about 15 minutes to cook when it's in the soup. Okay. okay. So you're an hour and a half here. You have 15 minutes left. Can you're you adding this in. Can you sub it out if you don't yeah. have fregula? Yeah. So you okay. could do our arancini, arancini di pepe, which is a very small pasta. I think it's right there, Matt, if yeah. you want to oh, look I at that. Okay. Okay, but we're going to mix this in. This is going to tighten this up even more now, right? 15 minutes later, this is going to be cooked. With that, you might have to add water to this. A little pepper, a little salt at the end. Don't salt in the beginning, salt at the end. This is what it's going to look like. Served with a little, a little Parmesan cheese, cheese oh, on yeah. the top. Good okay. stuff. A nice little garnish. Parsley. There's our group. Look, they're going to live to 100. You guys like it? What do you think, mm -hmm. guys? Delicious. It's nice. I'm on my way yeah, to yeah. 99. Okay, uh, good. Look, I think between that, the grape and this pasta, I think it's all the way to go. Anthony Scotto, really thank you so much. The recipe's on today.com. Tomorrow we visit a community here in the U.S. defying the laws of aging. We're back after your local news and weather.